Put another candle on your birthday cake. Your birthday cake. <laughs> Hello, friends. My name is Brandon Dayton. I'm your humble narrator. Welcome to Salt and Sanctuary, a game given to me during the hashtag IGC party from uh, at Indie Gamer Chick. Really, really cool lady, turned in 29. Happy, happy birthday. And uh, in exchange for these free games that she's giving out, she wants you to say a few words about it. Well, I'm going to do better than some some words, and I'm going to make a YouTube video. You know what I mean? Because that's what I do. Uh, I did make a, a, a couple of other game reviews, but this is one game that deserved a video. So we could uh, be a... A weird little frog creature, and we can be male or female. The the female looks horrifying, so I'm gonna be a male. And uh, then you pick your hairstyle here. You want to be a balding old man? I kind of do. Viceroy, Iron Man, Dom Bob. I think the uh, bandit shave is the best one. If you want me to be honest, I'm gonna have brunette hair like I do in real life. I'm gonna have a little mushy mustache like I do in real life or a uh, chin puff, as we call it here. And mine's more like a blonde color, but yeah, we'll, we'll do this. Hazelnut. Yeah, that's, that's how I'm looking. And blue eyes. And then we pick our origin. Where are you from, young man? Gulchmeyer, my god, that's terrifying. Tristan, that's also pretty terrifying. What is up with the Western Kingdoms? <laughs> Mark Door, Door Isle, uh, Tain of Beer. I really like this. There's probably some good lore behind all these places. The Citadel, Coast Rock, Kulakos. Hmm. I like the Citadel or Coast Rock fellows. That's looking pretty cool. Alright, I'll be Citadel. I am from the Eastern Lands because there's a bunch of freaks living on the Western Lands. Now we've got our classes. Oh yes. Uh, I'm not going to compare this to a certain other game, but you do collect... Uh, Something that starts with an S to level up, and then if you get killed by an enemy, you drop it and have to go retrieve it. We've got Paladin, Thief, Mage, Knight, Chef, Claire, po Cleric, Popper, or Hunter, which all seem really, really awesome. Um, I think I'm going to be a Thief. That seems like it would be pretty nice. You do have, obviously, some stuff in your loadout. I'm not sure what that potion for the Paladin does, but the Thief seems to have a bomb. The Chef has uh, potatoes, which is... <laughs> Pretty meme -y, if you would ask me. But yeah, let's let's be a thief. I'm going to take red shards, because that's some extra potions. Or grasping ring. Yeah, okay. We'll do the grasping ring, because, you know, he's a thief. he, he got to grasp stuff. Grab stuff. Grasp stuff. The world has known war for centuries. War never changes. But peace is finally preciously near. We deliver the princess to the kingdom across the sea where a marriage alliance would save us all. Failing this mission would surely plunge us into darker days. Oh no. It seems like pausing doesn't actually pause, so... <laughs> that's kind of weird for a game that I don't... I don't think it's multiplayer. Maybe it is. I don't know. But yeah, I gotta take care of my boy at the same time that I'm doing this, so that might be uh, slightly difficult. Oh, are you there, stranger? We've been bored in the night. They, they want to kidnap our lady at ransom her. Protect her! Save us! Oh, God! You just smacked me in the face. This thief has really nice attacks. They come out nice and quick, yes! Oh, boy. Uh, run away! <laughs> I'll grab this pot. Oh, my. How am I supposed to get up the ladder now? Drop attack. Yeah. Got him, coach. Look at that right there. And I've also got a grenade. Boom. That worked pretty good. 16 damage. That's what I'm talking about. Dude, this beat is awesome. I tried the uh, knight and the chef class already. I'm trying to get my bearings for this game just a little bit. And it's actually not too hard to understand. X to attack, Y is like a heavy attack, I guess. And uh, A to jump. B to interact with stuff. And we gotta fight Cthulhu. Cthulhu! Back from Riley, I see. Oh 
Oh god. He, he smashed me in one hit. I didn't even get a swing on him. I said failing this mission would surely plunge us into darker days. I woke to the sounds of waves washing on rock, and I knew I was alive. I must find the princess. I'm sorry, your princess, she's in another castle. Goodbye, crap on this. Toot toot. Alright, little thiefy, stand up. I know your legs are weak. Got some spindly little legs. Shivering shore. I really like the art style of this game. Holy god. It is awesome. Well, hello there, you're just a fleshy bit of floats and wants to show with the rest of us, hmm? You want shelter, you want sanctuary, but what is a sanctuary without faith? There's an empty sanctuary up the beach, you can claim it for your creed. Tell me, do you keep the new gods? No, I don't. You don't keep the new gods. Rare. Uh, you're a pilgrim of Dabara then. Your sword's been dying out for centuries, I'm afraid. Nah, that ain't me. No? You hold no gods at all. You're either brave, foolish, or from the north. You don't look particularly brave, but you don't seem particularly foolish either. Are you a mountain smith? I never made a mountain in my life, sir. No? What, what was your creed then? Uh, it was the three. Definitely not goddess of the light. Iron one seems kind of cool too, though. But I'm not from the north. Ah, shit. I'll break the mold. That's fine. Men from the mountains of the northern continent of Mokdor are iron ones. They believe in no gods, believing instead of the iron will of man. They love steel, but ain't magic. Are you a member of the iron ones, then? Yes, I am. You remember the iron ones, eh? Then no gods will help you here. Except this metal icon, then. Alright, super! And we got stuff to read. Instructions. Terrifying without brand. Without brandy. Things do get terrifying. I need a drink. Right trigger to roll. Yes. We've, we've covered this. We know all about this. It seems like these zombie guys have 30 health. Hit them for 30 and they go down easy. There's the sanctuary key. Wonderfully done. Switch items. Use equipped item. View inventory. Simple enough. Much as I would expect. Alright. Select icon. Uh, there's my metal icon. Here we are. Wonderfully done. Oh, welcome to my sanctuary. And I got some uh, hardy rolls for doing that. So that should allow me to heal up just a little bit. And what's in the chest? Red shard and pouch of salt. Oh yeah, I have a ring, don't I? What does this ring do? A painted white ring depicts two grasping hands on the continents a ring such as this would symbolize an unending desire increases salt obtained from slain enemies shit yeah dude so now I can level up faster because of my ring I don't know if I'm ever gonna replace this ring probably I will oh god ow everybody why please stop please be dead now I took a, a couple of hits there. Salt. Salt everything. Salt forever. Infinite salt. You know what I'm saying, kids? So now there's some people hung up. There's, uh, what's his name? Jack. Jack O'Lantern. <laughs> That's a good one. Tell you what. I'll get up here. Knock this dude around. And there's a guy on the top that's shooting me as well. Must be very aware of your environment in this game. Rotten Walker's ear. I'm gonna go break all this stuff. That's what I do now. Yeah! Cause I'm a thief! I'm a thief in the night! Oh baby! I gotta get that, uh, crossbow man. First things first. Whoa! Broke the barrels for me. I do appreciate it. Shazam! Got him! I really like, uh, cutting heads off and shit like that. That's amazing. And I do need to watch my stamina. Because that that shit goes pretty quick. It also recharges pretty quick. Pouch of salt. Little more salt for the date and do. Huzzah! And crack, cracky, crumbly platforms. Those delicious crumbly cookies. You can have them any time. Stellador breakfast treats. Oh my god. This big boy. He almost killed me. 
He almost killed me. Let's eat a hearty roll. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's nice. That's what I need. And it seems like I lost a little bit of uh, off my ma max HP, which I don't understand why. That's probably going to be a troubling thing. Maybe it's like, you know, you need to rest, something like that. Got another rotten walker's ear. Alrighty, no problem. Torches and throwing daggers. Very nice. I want to get rid of this crossbow guy before I take on this beast of burden. Oh, he's gone. He ran away! No, he didn't! Okay. That wasn't so bad. <laughs> that could have been a lot worse. Uh, can't seem to jump up there. So, let's continue on. There's like a bridge. So, we could probably cross the bridge. And then be able to do a thing. A couple of, uh, little baddies. Batty bat, bat baddies. Bat baddies. You know what I'm trying to say, don't you? Sure hope you do. Because I don't know what I'm trying to say. I'm going to bleed this dude. It's more uh, rogue gear, I guess. That's kind of weird. They give me a second set of gear. Is it different from what I'm wearing now? I guess I should check. Rogue's high boots. I've got two pairs of these. One has a, a rune written on it, which I guess... I guess means something. Oh, God! Bats. Always with the bats. My goodness. More grenades. That's always nice. Dodge this. Dodge this. Yeah. Got him, coach. Oh my god. I was dragging another zombie along with me. I didn't even notice. Bandage ring. Hmm. A ring of powerful healing. Its wearer may suffer injury, but lasting wounds will be made less severe. Reduces wounding effect, but its wearer will suffer injury, may suffer injury. I don't, I haven't seen anything that bleeds me just yet. I haven't been hit that many times, so I guess I'll not use it for now. Ooh, thought I was going to take some fall damage. I'm not sure if that's a thing or not. I sure hope not, though. Let's get the grenades ready. I'm going to bomb these dudes. I'm gonna bomb him hot. Bomb him hot. Yeah. Oh, that's so good. That's so good. Dang. I need to hang on to these grenades, though. And left button is switching my loadout, but I don't have anything else in my loadout. Let's drink some potion. Mmm. A motion of potion. And I don't want to go over there. Cross the bridge, and then we can go down to that door and get some treats, right? Right? That's the plan. What's this? Journey bottle. Oh, that sounds important. Is it like an Estus flask, perhaps? Yeah! And then I open this gate. Now I could go over here. I got a men spell. Oh, and this door's locked. This game is really puzzly, um, if you couldn't tell. It reminds me of... A lot of older games, you know? It's not one that's going to hold your hand to walk you all the way through. I am just a little bit rusty for that reason. And here we've got candles. Put another candle on your birthday cake. Your birthday cake. Happy birthday, Indie Gamer Chick. Yes, yes, indeed. Please don't blow that candle out because it is a, a checkpoint. <laughs> got some more potions. Stone Blacksmith. Which will allow me to put a blacksmith in my, uh, in my place. In my, my what you call it. Hmm. What will we do now? Well, I kind of want to go home. I had like a return bell, did I not? Hmm. Maybe we'll be okay. There's a boss up here. I had my ass handed to me on both characters that I made. And then I decided, hey, I should try and do this on, on camera, even though I haven't been able to do it yet. But, you know, third time's the charm. The thief has a lot of uh, damage that he's able to put out. So, my goodness. No, please. 
Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa! John Travolta! Um, oh god! Fart. I couldn't get to the roll fast enough. Oh, I was alive still! Alright, write that down for constructive criticism. Oh, wow. Oh, wow! Oh, wow! Holy shit! Please stop! Fuck! Oh boy. Don't do it. Shit! All right. God damn it. No, no, no. Not like this. Not like this! All right, eat the roll. Eat the fucking roll! <laughs> I hate it. I hate it so much. Ah, oh, crap! Crap and a half! Ah! I'm running low on gold. I'm losing all my gold here! God. Fart. Alright. Saw the night. You make me so wet. Oh my god. All I really need is a level up. But this guy's... Yeah, stolen all my salt. What am I gonna do? I'm gonna try and beat his ass. I can't guarantee that it's gonna work, but... We have to try. We have to do our best, gentlemen. Kinda got the timing down a little more now. Oh, I rolled into it. Why would I roll into it? There we go. Just pin his ass to the wall. Yeah! Get some, bitch. I gotta wait for my stamina. Oops. Oops. No! God damn it. Are you kidding me? Eat the roll. Eat the fucking roll! <laughs> oh, God. Alright. Dude, he's hitting so hard. He's moving faster. Alright. How about, uh... Damn it. How about I just get my shit kicked in? Alright. Stamina, go! Yes! Yes! Oh, thank God. I got all my stuff back. Vanquished. You have been vanquished. The Sodden Knight's Ashes and a Fortress Key. So I guess the fortress is the next place we're going. This place kind of looked like a fortress to me too. Oh, shit. I meant to go to that thing and heal up and get more breads. I need more breads. There we go. Everything's good now. Oh my god. What a run for my money that guy gave, huh? I think there's some more stuff in there. Like, I ended up opening a gate early on. So, am I supposed to go through that gate? Yeah. They couldn't just let you go from one boss to the next. Yeah, just, just, just head on through. Head on through, gentlemen! Everything's gonna be fine! Oh, jeez, fart. There you go. Chewed up. Chewed up real good. Now that I got my salt back, I should probably uh, get home. Hey! <laughs> Kick ladder? Yeah, it sounds good. Oh, so I can skip past the first little bit of the fortress. That's nice. That's nice of them. But I'm gonna go to the sanctuary now. Sanctuary! Ascend to level 3? About 4, 5. Yeah, ascend to level 5. Now we big! Big shit popping. Little shit stopping. So we start out with this class 1 assassin, and then we're able to uh, level up into some other stuff. Class 1 light armor, class 1 archer. I don't think I even have a bow or anything. Class 1 sword fighter, poultice pouch. Aged Wisdom. Hmm, I'm not sure. I want to go to that that one there, Heavy Armor. No, I don't want Heavy Armor. <laughs> There's a lot of stuff to do, though. Pole axes, Reaper Spears. Gain one point of dexterity as well. That's rather nice. I gotta pick something. Hmm. But I don't have to pick it right now. Ha ha ha. Stone Merchant, Stone Blacksmith. Yeah, I'm going to use both of these. 
and that will uh, summon some dudes to my position. Hey, bruh, need some smithing? I don't know. I want to buy something. He's got a sword, he's got a crossbow. So I could buy a ranged weapon, and that might be better than shitty throwing daggers all the time. So yeah, let's do that. Class 1 Archer. Please. Please give to me! Gain 1 Willpower. Class 1 Marksman. Crossbows and pistols versus bows. So I think I need Marksman, right? I can't quite get over there yet. First I gotta do Light Armor. I still can't do Marksman. Damn it! Damn it, damn it! You can wield whips if you go Hunter. Hmm. That could be fun. Fortified Strength. Yeah, I want to hit harder. I want to hit things harder! Um... Where was that? Here. Oh, that's locked too. I've got to follow the web, you see? Follow the web! Additional healing potion. Man, I only got one point left. I want to get the crossbows and pistols. Well, I guess it be what it be. I'll get my point of dexterity, and I'll call it good. So, was he selling a bow? Or not? I think it was a crossbow. Yeah, I still can't use that. Crap! Crap and a half! Class 1 sword, so I need to level up that as well. Heater shield, wooden targe. Hmm. And then he's got some, uh, cotton. Cotton clothes. Can I just upgrade? That's what I'm gonna do. I want to upgrade my weapons. Midshipman's Dirk. Alright. How much? 250 salt and a lock of hair. I don't have a lock of hair. Dang. I guess I need to, uh, get this arming sword. I do have enough gold for it. Is it gold or is it cheese? I think it's gold. Alright, give me the arming sword. We're done here. Thank you so much. Keep your wits about you. Yes, indeed I shall. Uh, let's equip this with the arming sword. There. And it definitely doesn't come out as fast as the dagger. But that's alright. We could sell some items here? Yeah. Rogue gloves for 50. Rogue mask for 50. Here we go. 200 gold, right quick. Maybe I could buy something now. Shock stone. Ooh, apply it to your weapon to add lightning damage to your attacks? Uh, yes please. Could I have two of these? I would like two. Purchase item? Yes indeed. Flintlock shot, flame arrow, arrow, glowing shot, torch. Bell of return. Dragon tooth. Oh, a pointed metal throwing blade. Hmm. Pitch fire. Add fire damage to your attacks. Berian fire. I guess that's something else to throw, isn't it? Maybe? I don't have enough money for any of this anyways. I'm just shopping around. I'm just a looky-loo at this point. So, um... Where's my inventory? There we go. I do have a bell of return. I just didn't know how to get to it. Because I'm dumb! Alright. Shocking attacks. Now I switch. Oh! It's to both of my weapons. I thought I had to apply one to each. But alright. Whatever. Can I, can I go in here? I guess not. Fine, fine. Wow, I really thought I would be able to kill with one shot. One shock. <laughs> oh, it's only two swings now instead of three. Oh, but my... Shocking damage goes away after a minute. So I gotta be a little bit more careful. A little bit more uh, smart about when I apply that. Dang. Oh no! I gotta get this dude. Get that dude first, then jump down there and get the other. Alright. Piece of cake. Yaw, trick! Yaw, tricks! If I just keep killing stuff, then I can get uh, an infinite amount of salt. Is that is that what I understand? 
Especially with my super salt ring. It's awesome. It's so good for you. It'll make you strong and healthy. Oh, I thought this door was open. Maybe it's another door. My man staff inside you. They leave notes, just like in uh, another game, which I'm really trying hard not to compare this game to. Don't say the other game. Everybody knows what I'm talking about. But I don't want to say it. All right. So I guess I could have just climbed the ladder and skipped that pat that first little bit, but I don't wanna. I don't wanna. Oh, I could jump down probably, right? Gotta go up there and then I can jump down and grab some more treats. Oh god, fuck! Ow, I forgot! I'm supposed to be doing a thing! Alright. Hey, hey. Go to hell. Go to hell and you die. I should also look for a lock of hair and whatnot. What is that skull at the top? What's it counting down to? What is this? Why anything anymore? There's a stone cleric. Oh, so I can bring a cleric to my sanctuary. That would have been a good thing. Whatever. We good. I don't think I want to go that way. Gotta go out here. Hey, Wolfie. What's up, bro? How you living, man? Cool, cool. I'll see you later then. So there's probably a key that I need to get in order to, uh, get through that locked gate. But where to search for the key? Yes, indeed. Hmm. I think I've gone up this way before. Looks familiar, at least. Oops, oops, oops. Kill them dead. I just love when their heads fly off. That's fantastic! Made of plastic! Oops, I ran out of stamina. I'm dumb! Rotten Walker's ear. Kill the skull bat! Damn it! He just got so many cheap shots on me. They're so fast. Oh, I wasted another forest fang. I was trying to eat some bread, is what I was trying to do. So now that I've defeated the, the sodded knights, can I put his ashes here? What am I supposed to do with his ashes? Oh, don't pause. Don't pause, there's enemies about. Hmm. Maybe I don't do anything with his ashes. I, I'm not sure. Hmm. A key dropped by the sodden knight. Yeah. But I don't see his ashes anywhere. Oh, there, there, there. His charge was to protect the fortress that became known as the Festering Banquet. When and how the fortress became a cursed place remains a mystery. It can be used as a transmutation material or exchange with a leader. Transmutation material? How do I do that? Somebody tell me. I don't know what's going on. Oh, wow. Hey, everybody. Hi, nice, nice to see ya. Thanks for stopping by. A little more salt, a little more money. That ain't never hurt nobody. And I guess this is supposed to lead somewhere. Maybe I go up. I'm so lost. The festering banquet has consumed my soul. Alright. Head over here. Go ahead and save. Because we leveled up and did all that shit. And then we just gotta find our way through. That's easy, right? Use Fortress Key. Yes! Okay. Now we're cooking with gas. Greetings, Traveler. Do you have a quest? Um, I mean, not really. I was just chilling, trying to find a princess. Oh, I guess the princess is my quest. God damn it, I lied. That's unfortunate. Everyone needs a quest. Would you like to know about my quest? Sure. Excellent. My quest is to invade that castle to the east, defeat its guardians, and slay the dragon. Castles must be invaded and dragons must be slain, mustn't they? Yes, indeed. I wish you best of luck with that, sir. Another black pearl I can level up. That'll be quite nice. Drop down. Well, no shit. <laughs> if you haven't learned that by now, let me tell you. Secret right. 
Is it? Is it a secret? Is there a secret? Am I supposed to be doing something? Something or other? Well, I don't really know. There's a secret to the right down there, apparently. Hey, what's up with this? Take oath? Oh, I can change my guardian? I'm not gonna do that. That's blasphemy, dude. But I will level up. Shazam! Tree of skill? I've got two more black pearls! Yes! I want to get my, uh, crossbow. Crossbow action. Come on, purchase the skill! I don't understand why I can't. It's so mean. Oh, we'll get some more dexterity, how about? And then... What else do I want? Sword fighter. Wield class 1 swords, that seems important. We need poultice pouch? Probably. Alright, done here. Thank you! Hi there! Hello traveler, you're a stranger to the forest light, are you not? Uh, yes I am. We're pilgrims of the goddess Tavara, illuminator of all. Without light there is nothing. It is said in darkness chaos dwells, and in chaos there is hope. Every night the sun sets, and we see her light flicker at candles and torches, but the dawn of the next day is her blessing. Chaos is quelled, orders restored. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm a fan of chaos. Can't you see? I am a thief! I'm a thief of the night! Don't talk to me about this anymore. Three bells of return. Wow. I'm sure there's going to be some stuff going on over here. And yeah. Like I said a little bit earlier, that, that background, uh, that background, or foreground, that's what I mean. Putting the platforms in the background and having to work your way through the foreground is a little bit frustrating for this game. But other than that, shit, this is, this is a, a beauty, a masterwork. Holy shit. Please leave me alone. I ask you one time to leave me alone. Do I have some... A water blessing. Do I drink this? I guess I do. Holy god. What a slaughter. Stop it! Stop it, everyone! Oh, I got a crossbow. Now I have a crossbow. I didn't even have to, to buy it. Secret up. Oh, yeah. I do see a secret up there. Question being, how to get up? Hmm. Oh my god. This shit is going mad. Wow! You hit me from all the way over there? I can't help but be a little bit impressed. I gotta admit, I'm impressed. Slay the wolves. And out come the wolves! And out come the wolves! Oh wow, god, shit! That was crazy. That crazy! Cray cray! Hey, baby! And now we're back here with the, the clerics of Debara. Wonderful. Not as hot as Debella, but still fairly wonderful. So I gotta go and slay my, my slayer. At least he's not a boss. He's just a dude. I'm just a dude pretending to be another dude! Oh, God. This is so horrifying. Did I get my salt back? I don't think I did. Gotta go get that that dude. Yeah, yeah, that that's the guy. That's the fucking guy! <laughs> and he destroyed me again. A thousand salt forever! Alright, about now is where I rage quit. <laughs> oh shit. Well, friends, it happens. Death is a thing. But this game is absolutely awesome. Um despite the little bit of salt that it gives me IRL. But yeah, check it out for yourself. Link is in the description. Big thanks to Indie Gamer Chick for letting me check it out. And a big thanks to Ska Studios for donating keys for this game. They got some good stuff over there. Ska Studios has turned my head officially, so I'm going to check out some more of their games. I'm going to play some more Salt and Sanctuary because I know I can be better. I can be better. I can get bigger. I can do more things. Just like... IRL as well. Anyways, friends, 
Thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to like, comment, and to subscribe if you did enjoy the episode. That is always, always appreciated. We've also got links in the description to Twitter, Discord, Patreon. Big thanks to Nico the Legend and MMX Akira for supporting us on Patreon currently. But you could join the ranks uh, if you were so inclined. I would appreciate it, you know, if you could spare it. Anyways, friends, once again, this has been Salt and Sanctuary. I've been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. I shall see you in the next one. And until then, bye-bye. One, two, three, four. Goodbye, goodbye, see you again. Goodbye, goodbye, see you, my friend.